Danny Rose, that's twice in a week you've made me lose my voice. Yeah, great moment again in front of us fans. Uh, we knew there was we knew there was time by the referee signal for eight minutes, I think it was. So we knew there was time. I think they were cramping up at the end, so they was getting tired. Um, but like I say, it's a great moment for us to get a point away from home. It shows that the, the squad have got great belief in themselves that they can keep producing these results. Yeah, it's great character from the lads. Uh, I think the subs made an impression again today. Every single sub that came on seems to have been doing that uh, all season from Tramia through to this game. So uh, it's nice to get on um, and hopefully continue that now throughout the season. I, you look at the performance, it perhaps wasn't the best performance. You came up against an awkward side. Um, we just said to Steve, you, you have to find a way. I didn't think there was much in it, to be honest. I think their goal's a little bit sloppy from us. A long throw, we should do better with it. First contacts, maybe I couldn't really see it, to be honest. But um, like I said, we just kept going until the end. We, sh- we showed great character on Tuesday and, and now today. But we're just selling the chain room. I think the skip said it. We, we could do something special here. Um, if, if we just start games well and give ourselves a chance and maybe not go 1 0 down to start a game, then we, we could do something special here. I guess there's only so many times you can take it to the last 10 minutes before getting the result. Yeah, like I said, we knew there was belief when the referee played. I'm not too sure where he got the eight minutes from, to be honest. But um, as soon as reed has got the ball, I, I peer around the back and look enough to keep the flaps it in. I've, I've managed to guide it in. And right in front of the Stevenage fans as well. Yeah, like I said, it was a, it was a great moment, apart from getting booked. I'm, I'm not too sure why he's booked me, to be honest. I, said, I, I started the riot from the Stevenage fans, but I'm not too sure about that one. But like I said, it, it was worth it. Um, how have you found things? I mean, obviously, you've <clears> not been getting the start, but you've had to be patient and... You're knocking on the door, aren't you? I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. It's a good setup at Stevenage. Uh, training's been good. The gaffer and the assistant and Revs have been good. And we've got a good group. We've got a really good group. And there's belief there. Um, and now it's five subs this season. It's, it's, it's more of a team thing, uh, especially with five subs. And, and we've utilised that. The gaffer has with five subs. So as long as we keep changing the game, then we'll be knocking on the door. And moving on to Rochdale, um, we were suggesting that that last-minute goal puts you in a good place going into another game. Yeah, the positives, we're unbeaten. Uh, we're unbeaten in four now, three, four, something like that. Uh, and we've got two home games. Uh, it's going to be tough, though, Rochdale and Carlisle, I think it is going to be tough games. I'm not too sure how they've got on today, but every every game in League 2 now is tough. But we've got confidence, we're unbeaten like Walsall has, so uh, we'll take it to choosing now. And it's been a tough start to the season, hasn't it? You've played some of the top sides. Yeah, we have. Stockport, I think they've won today as well. They'll be up there. Tranmere, we've got a good result today as well. They'll be up there. So, like you said, we have had a, we've had a tough start. Walsall away. It's, it's not a nice place to come to. They've got a good manager and a good team and, and they'll be up there at the end of the season. So, like I said, I think before the game, if we offered us a point and still unbeaten, you'd have probably took that. Well done today. Thank you.